Nobody ever says anything nice about binge drinkers, do they? They just said binge drinkers, look what they've done. Look at the binge drinkers. Look, look what they've done to the town centre. They think, we didn't ruin the town centre. Tesco's and the internet did that. <laughs> We're just finishing the job. <laughs> it's like farting in a cheese shop. It's not the main problem. <laughs> Kicking a dead bird. <laughs> what are you doing? It's dead. Chill out. <laughs> Put a bit of chewing gum in a mullet. No, and it's terrible the discrimination you suffer as a binge drinker. You know? I know, I've been for job interviews, and I know the only reason I didn't get that job is because I was hammered. <laughs> they couldn't see beyond that. They couldn't see the person behind the, the man have, trying to get a sing-song going, you know? <laughs> I get knocked down, but I get up here. <laughs> Where'd you see yourself in five years' time, Mr Locke? Pub! Ha! <laughs> And the press are very complicit in this. They know the press. They, they really like to make binge drinkers feel bad. I remember there was a picture once in the son of this girl in Newcastle. She was on a night out in Newcastle. And uh, for a laugh, she pulled her... She kept her clothes on, but for a laugh, she pulled her knickers down to her ankles. And she was standing in the centre of Newcastle, just going, Wee! Big smile on her face, like that. Wee! And the headline above her was something like, Oh, God. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. And I remember looking at the picture thinking, What is wrong with that? She's obviously having a brilliant time. You've got to be in a fantastic mood to be in the heart of the town where you live, where you go shopping, you go to work, you meet friends, to be in the very epicenter of where all your friends go the whole life is to go, ha, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> ha, ha! <laughs> That's a great moment in your life. I put that on my CV. <laughs> there we go, happiest I've ever been. That's also the answer to hobbies and interests. <laughs> I've never met anybody who's depressed who's done that. I've never chatted to anybody who's depressed. How are you feeling? I feel terrible. Every decision I make is a disaster. I just can't see a way of muddling through this miserable period in my life. The other day, I, I went down to the canal. I was, <laughs> I was just staring at the dark black water, <laughs> trying to find a good reason to carry on with this miserable <laughs> existence we laughingly call life. 